Right, so apparently there is a Titan suit in the game. There it is. Let's go ahead and get it delivered. We're going to look at what components it has first. Uh, this is a very rough video. I'm literally just going to record this and go. It's kind of first reaction sort of thing. Uh, so let's check out the vehicle thing. Atlas. Uh, no skins for it now, right now. Vehicle. It's holding a ball or something. I uh, can't seem to change anything right now. Okay, so let's go ahead and spawn it. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval. Right, it's, it's it's pretty. Sh it's not as big as I thought it would be. It's kind of short. Let's see. Yeah, it's not much taller than a, a character. Uh, there's Pete there. It's where Pete's with me. Alright. Uh, I don't see any components. Access to any components, if it did have any. Anything on the back? Nope. Anything in the butt? Nope. Right, so it doesn't look like it has any kind of components or anything. Let's jump in. Ooh, frame rate's not great, but that's where it is. Right, so uh, I have no idea what this is. Uh, I'm guessing this is. Oh, I can't seem to zoom into it. Broken. I mean, this is this is PTU. I guess whatever this says is broken. Um, That's cool. I don't know what this says on the right. I guess uh, right controls. What do we have? We have exit. Nothing else. All right, anything in the wheel? Actions, player. Right, there's no vehicle stuff. Right. This max speed. Right, there's a sprint. Can it sprint? Yeah, I'm just literally doing that right now. It's just saying. Right, I go full speed. Can you keep up with me? All right. So yes. So that's sprinting right now. It's like a fast walk. I scroll the mouse wheel down to go slower. Nope. So like the scrolling your mouse would, if you were in FPS, would would alter your uh, walking running speed. Uh, is there a crouch? No crouch, no jump, some side strafe. Okay, left. <laughs> side step looks dumb. <laughs> uh, so we do look like we have a tractor. Can you spawn like a 1SC box or something like that if you have access to it? Sure, one sec. Whoa, that's quick. <laughs> Whoa, that's quick. Oh. Okay, that's probably why it's like placing. Oh, right. So it grabs it, and then you get a hologram where you want to place it. No, when you go, you know when you go place item, you'll get like a box showing you where you want to place it. So it's not like a track yeah. It's like a grab, place, grab. Oh, okay. And then place that there. Grab, place. Oh, that is. I don't know where that went. Yeah, it's fine. It's gone behind you, it's been yeeted. Can't grab you. Alright, I guess we'll uh, we'll see if it can survive a drop from a height. Alright, back. So, before we get into space, there was something I wanted to try. I was about to spawn a ship and I thought, oh, I've got a Halle. I wonder if we can snap it to our cargo grid. Uh, you cannot snap it to our cargo grid. Uh, but we also wanted to see if you could grab it with another one. It looks like you can grab it. Uh, also, you can carry these. It's slow and sluggish, but you can lift them with a track rifle. Right, so can you grab it like a box? It says I'm supporting it. It's going towards you. There doesn't seem to be a place item. It just comes towards me and then I can drop it. 
Try again. No, it's just it Wait, just one minute. So what I mean. Oh, I can't even lock onto you. Oh, I can't lock onto you now. Okay, uh, get out of here for a second. I don't know what the other I don't know what the other arm is for. Push and pull. Right, so it doesn't act like a trap. Anyway, it's weird. I think it's just acting weird because it's a weird thing. Right, let's get shit. Yeah, you wanna grab that and take it off the pad. Give me a sec. Will it fit in an elevator? Oh yeah, oh, yeah. Forgot about that. I would imagine. I see you be like. I'll just get teleported, <laughs> probably like uh, if you were taking a hover bike. And get the button. Doesn't look like it should. No, but. Wait, can you interact with the elevator panel while being yeah, in it? Yeah, you, you can activate with panels while being on, and bikes and cars and that. Just gotta get close enough. Oh, cool. I clicked the button, nothing's arrived. Get out and do it. I can't quite get close enough. I think we're too tall as well. Yeah, that's not going in there. I've spammed the fuck up, I don't think it's working. Ah well, that was worth a try. Alright, so we're in space. Let's see how she reacts in uh, zero gravity. Oh, yeah, I got no no movement no, no, whatsoever. No. So we're skiing down the ramp. I'm getting out before we go too far. Yeah, it can't even rotate rounds. Yeah, if you start, if you get out, it stops. Alright. Thankfully, I bought a tractor rifle with us. Alright, so you can't use it in space then? Confirmed. So we'll, we'll uh, drop it from a height to see if you can survive. I don't know where the tractor beam's taking that. It's like, well, I don't know why we're going all the way off to the right there. Oh, I'm guessing the support bug. Yep. I was expecting a clank with that fail. Menu. Right, so hot drop time. Uh, I am not in orbit because uh, it'd take forever. We're just kind of above the clouds. Uh, I was going to use the bombs to hot drop me, but unfortunately, Pete has the arm assist bug where it thinks he's an arm assist, so he can't actually open the bomb doors. So we thought that'd be a cool kind of clip, but anyway, so let's check it out. Can you survive impact with the ground? Hopefully this doesn't take us too long, uh, or we don't land in somewhere that's going to immediately claim it. Alright, a little cut. It was taking quite a long time to uh, drop, so I stopped the recording. Alright, so we're nearly there. Uh, some things to notice, I can't move, just like in zero gravity. So I have no control, I can't twist or anything.
Also seems to be limited camera controls. I can't move my camera away that far. It's it's like it's like somewhere between a vehicle and FPS. Like there's some weirdness to it. Oh, hello, ground. Are you my friend? Yep, no problem. Here comes PE. Right, so you can hot drop from them, not a problem. So, kind of curious if we could fit in a bunker. We're going to go off to a bunker next to see if it will fit for the bunker door. It might be too tall, it might be too wide. I think it might be too wide, but I guess we'll find out. Right, so we're at the bunker. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't fit. <laughs> it's too tall. Um, and you can't side strafe. Um, you also can't rotate the suit with a track dream, so you can't even rotate it. There's like some like self-leveling thing going on where you can't actually rotate it or fall over or anything, So, which is good, I guess. Uh, let's go. We're going to do one more test because it's super late for me and I need to quickly edit this video, thumbnail, all that stuff. Um, let's, let's go see if it's waterproof. Oh, okay. I can't... Yeah, it's, it's weird. It it kind of acts like a vehicle and not a vehicle. It's like between the two kind of things. So I don't I, I don't know how if we will survive. Oh, it's literally inside that pipe. There's no getting. It's literally merged inside that pipe. I don't think we're getting out of there. All right, all right. Let's do the water test. Uh, do it over here. I should do it here. What the hell? Will I blow up? No, okay, so it's waterproof. Alright, there's a bug where it looks like I don't have a helmet on, but I do have a helmet on. Otherwise, I'd be suffocating here. Well, that's interesting. What happens if I backspace? Nothing. Okay. Right, so we're at an outpost here. We want to grab a couple of different sized boxes. Uh, just FYI, you can spawn this on the... Vehicle, the, the vehicle terminal at the the ASOP outpost for ground vehicles. Um, you can use the track dream here, so it counts like That's a vehicle track dream. That's the biggest one you can here, the 24. Yeah. Not moving on my screen. Now it is. So Nate is fine. A little weird. Now it is. There's a weird thing, but I think that's more to do with the geometry of the pad. Hold down right mouse button when you're holding something in the track to me. Oh, it just jobs it. Yeah, you get like a little power up meter on the display. Do you? Oh. Which display? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, we need to get a chair. A few to sit in. <laughs> Can you fire? Right, you need to fire a box at me. Full yeet. Yeah, full yeet. Here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Can I grab that from way over there? <laughs> Like Pete, Pete was saying earlier, that I'll the be back range. Back in a second, I'm at Hurston. Oh, you did! You actually died, lol. <laughs> oh, I just exploded. <laughs> the charging. Yep. All right, guys. So that is 
kind of us today. Uh, it's a quick video. I have to go to bed. Unfortunately, there's so much more science I want to do, but I, I kind of want to make a quick video about the new mech suits. I love them. They're really cool. Uh, I can't wait to do some more science with them. But anyway, if you liked the video, uh, give us a thumbs up, uh, thumbs down, leave a comment, all that lovely stuff. And thank you very much. And I'll catch you on the next one. And thanks for thanks to Pete there for helping out with some stuff. So uh, goodbye. Oh wait, I'll give you a little wave. Be there. It's a little bit fun. Bye bye. Leave a little hand. <laughs> All right, guys, have a good one. I'll see you uh, in the next video.